Welcome, 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 champions. Great J-Man Gaming here. So, new free-to-play character. Haven't even seen Booker yet, but I am a fan. So let's go get our... Oh, there's our Booker right there. Let's claim him. I guess I could have probably bought... If I was going to buy the offer, I could have bought that and then claim this after and got 20 20 whopping shards but whatever it's shards i don't really care book let's take a look at him oh i already got a milestone in the town up i have no idea what stacy's like i assume she'll be like some kind of top tier character all right where's my booker it'll be the low end of my talents so all right what do we got here booker powerhouse trainer Green gem trainer. All right, that's nice. That's nice. I love these flat damage uh, gem trainers. They're nice. All right, first of all, starting small. Devon! Might as well use it. Might as well use it. You are jealous of this. I can tell. Why, Devon, you ask? Well, just just because. Just because I can. It's a move. I don't really care. I'm not even going to photograph that one. That was a waste of time. I know it. You know it. We all know it. Ember Moon. The Sheenom, because she is a trainer that I like. She is the, um, I forget what she trains again. Oh, yeah, Coach. She's more green gems on the initial gem board trainer, or the Coach. So we'll go ahead and enhance her. All right. Next up is Hall of Fame Eddie Guerrero. Again, he's a useful coach. I don't really care about the Hall of Fame. I already got uh, Hall of Fame Stone Cold at five star. I'm really only taking him nine k for that extra purple gem. Very useful for guys like well, a lot of guys make purple, and I have a lot of tricksters. So we'll make this move. Maybe I'll get the gear for Eddie. If I get the gear, I'll consider taking him up. But if without the gear, I'm less motivated. I'll just throw him in as a second player for the Hall of Fame tag link. That's about it. It's been a long time coming for Cesaro. Because, as you know, he is the uh, coach. And he's a really critical coach. He's the green MP reduction coach. And very, very useful. These these MLC chase guys we've been getting with the, um, the, the, the MP point reduction are really, really, really useful in Showdown. I like him a lot. All right, Cesaro, looking good there, Green Lantern. Next, we have Afa, the Wild Samoan, going to five-star um, bronze. He's pretty good. I mean, it doesn't blow me away, but for a Legends era guy, he can spam the board with a lot of gems. I like him. He's fun. Go ahead and do this move. King Buka. This I prefer to Cesaro myself. Uh, I'm going to take him to 5-star silver. I know he has two hollow stars, but whatever. I don't really care. Oh yeah. Okay, so we're going to push Mankind, Zombie Mankind, or Zako as some like to call him, to four-star silver. I actually really like this character. He's fun. He recovers health. I know he's not the greatest trickster, but he is really good for, like, um, well, I'd say for feud, he's probably pretty damn decent. I don't know if I'd use him much for showdown, but we'll see. All right, so we're back. I did the boring <laughs> TP up on all of Morrison Drip Drip's moves, and now we're going to take him to five-star because he is another one of those great MP reduction coaches. Uh, so here we go, another five-star made for this event. Kind of a cool character. I'm not the hugest fan of Acros, admittedly, but uh, I like this character. He's kind of cool. Uh, he's great for stip tours for blue. Oh my god, so good for that. 
Uh, I forget what his five star move is. Oh yeah, choose that two by two area to destroy, so he can keep cycling those um multi gems. So that kind of really unlocks a good build for him. Uh, the other thing I got for him is an affiliate strap, so I can actually put this guy onto two people as a MP reduction trainer, which is nice. Um, so I I kind of like the look of Booker. I haven't seen vid on him yet, but uh, I'm a Booker fan. Who doesn't like Booker sucker? Um. I'm gonna, I bought the fuse up. I hate grinding normal blitz. I hate it. I'd rather just shove a toothpick in my eye. I can't do it. I can't, I can't grind normal blitz. I can't do it. I gotta at least do hard. Normal's just too damn painful for my life. Oh, this pains me. Do I do it? Do I have the tokens? Yeah, I got tokens up the yin yang for this. This, this pains me. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna take Bray Wyatt to four stars. After all this time, he sat on my roster, three-star gold, unevolved, but yuck, it is what it is. All right, there we go. He was nasty a long time ago. All right, let's look at my 20,000 shards for him, though. I'm finally putting these shards to use, all those Bray pulls. All right, up you go, Kofi. Finally taken the power positivity, formerly Enzo, and then formerly, what was it, Akum? And now Kofi. All right, well, the things we do for Talent Up. Uh, I'm going to take uh, APA to five star as well. I do have the tokens for it, so might as well do it. I was going to do Zombie Triple H, but uh, he needs way too much TP, and I've already maxed the TP event. So just be wasting resources off event, which that ain't no good for anybody. What does he get for five-star move? Oh, the blue MP steal. All right, so here we are. I did manage to max this talent up. That was not easy. Uh, I didn't go too far above the coin amount, but a little bit. Maybe buy like 3 million or something. I figured I'd just collect the last milestone here. And give a recap of where I'm at with my roster in this event. So let's just claim this reward here. So we get this um, coin that lets you pick a skill play to your choosing. Time once again. That's the one I need for Cesaro. Break three or more purple, get three or more yellow move points. Yep, that fixes Sidaro's issue for sure. Just double checking there's nothing else I need. The smoke. Blue get purple. Or those gem ones. No, nope, it's definitely time once again. That's the plate I want. Nice. Well, anyways, good luck in this event. Uh, MLC looks okay. It's not often we get a female chase character, but uh, should be decent. I remember Lana was pretty good. DX Army Trish was pretty good. So don't count out a chase just because they're female. Uh, they should be pretty awesome. Plus the free-to-play booker looks decent. Uh, best of luck to you and your talent up. I'll probably be doing a roster update in a few days, just once I get a chance to go through my roster, post talent up, and sort out my plans. Anyway, thanks for watching. Cheers.